this is Lucas and welcome back to Planet Coaster. Today I'm going to be finishing up this coaster and possibly starting a whole new one. We'll just see how things go. As you can see, I left off this coaster by just having going down and I'm going to have a, a down spiral. Ooh, that is cool. I'm just gonna have that there because that that's cool. That's just what I wanted. Now it looks as cool as can be. Now probably do have quite a bit of speed here, so if I just get back to that height right about here there we go let's see if the test which actually we should have this on test Testing test ratings. Okay. Click on this coaster. Start test. Let's see. Um. Can I build this while <coughs> while doing this? Um. Let's see. Obviously, the chain lift is too slow. Chain speed. 14 miles per hour. That is going to be much better. Let's take a little watch here. See, I'm not even sure if this works yet. Poster looks pretty cool from the ride position. <coughs> the drive tires are pushing it along. And then the drop. Not a really big drop because it goes back up. <coughs> beginning of the stage. How excellent. Not very though. Let's just not go as high. Let's just build from here and here. Ooh, and that's a perfect connection. And I saved the train. As we can see, the train is gonna wrap along here. An excellent turn there. Woo! And die. That took a while to hit the ground. Now I know that I can continue because this coaster works. There we go. For some reason, the options weren't popping up. I'm going to go down. Whoa! That was actually really cool. I'm just going to leave it at that. Some of the times, I just 
do what's already generated there, and it actually comes pretty cool like this. And now, for like the fifth time, we're going over this rail. Actually, here I'm going to have it go like this. And, and the wrap. Actually, want it to continue straight, and I'm going to turn on auto tunnel. And I am actually going to just dig a straight down. here and twist it around because I need space here to build other coasters and let's see how the test goes start the test For this little part, I'm not going to talk, so you can experience it yourself. Again, going down over what I already did with a cool tunnel. Ooh, spiral up. That is very interesting. I like it. I just want to build now nicely, easily done. some straight rail for a second. Auto tunnel is now back on. That is a very steep drop. to here. This may not make it. Okay, now I'm going to straighten it. I want it to be... I want to have a little snake here.
1.0, that's great. <clears throat> now take this around here with drive tires. Again, kind of sticking. So the same thing I did at the beginning. There we go, great. And as I can see, it actually makes it. That is so great. At the same time, I want to kind of twist this way. <clears throat> Whoa, and it goes. Here, how much can I shorten it? Close up. to the normal length. That's normal length. I'm not sure. I am just going to <coughs> drive this back to the station. here because I am going to drop it. I just need a little fun at the end. I don't want to disappoint anybody. Here we go. Straightening back out. for a second and the game extremely glitched for now it just it's being left off right here when it pulls out to the station which is not very good turn it a little more vigorously here and that's a nice nice turn back into the station and before I even do this to go to scenery. <coughs> I'm going to go to props. <coughs> Not sure where it would be. <coughs> lights. Where would I find lights? <coughs> lights. Has nothing possible for oil. <coughs> Here are the nice oil lamps. <coughs> oil lamps. Oil lamp. Always use oil lamp one. Here we go. <coughs> That's way too bright for any source of lights at all. Okay, it goes around here. The next tunnel is in here. Feels like I've already covered this area. Which is very confusing. Oh, here we go. This is the dark cavern. I really like this part. I think it's just so cool. Look at this dim lighting. And then there's just a futuristic roller coaster darting through it is amazing and and that 
appears to be it for the lights. Just taking this all in, it's so cool. Lights don't really work here. They only work when you go a certain deep amount. Okay, let's get in here. Supposed to be dimly lighted awesomeness. <coughs> Never used that term, I don't think. That tunnel leads to there and it is done. This tunnel is not done. hoping for it's time to ride coaster it's time to ride the coaster which pause the game Perfect timing I don't need to be here anymore click here and ride and before I get in the ride I need to play There's some finalizations I need to make right over here. Edit track. I don't want to start over there, but yet I need to get these. And chain speed is good. Okay. Let's play the game. Click here. And right. Here we go. Goodbye. <coughs> Waving us to our death. a very weird position when you're going up next to a dummy. <coughs> I hope a crash doesn't happen, yet I am not sure. <coughs> Go the drive tires. And I love how this futuristic looking car looks underground with the oil lamps. They just, they blend so well together. Going underground was a good idea for this coaster. Now you've already seen this part. We go down. Awesome. We come back up. We pass the coaster a lot of times. We got some good views. And a nice tunnel. A short tunnel. That was my least favorite tunnel because of how short it is. Then this tunnel, really cool. Then this tunnel, which is amazing. And then we come back up here. Use our drive tires. And, seems like that's kind of a launch. That is a very jerky place. There we go. pull back into base. Not really base. Just so used to saying that in Factorio. Because when I drive my trains. But this has been good. I think I'm going to leave it here. And see you next time. Next time I will make another coaster. I hope you enjoyed. And this is Lucas signing out.